Hi, I'm Abby, and today we're gonna make a mouse. And I'm gonna, I'm, this is gonna be kind of like a surprise. I made a lot of these mice. Um, but at the end, I'll show you them. So it's kind of a surprise, I guess. Really? And this is for beginners now. So if you just you are making the bracelets and you kind of want to make some animals, but you don't know if you're gonna succeed or you kind of want to get up to like. Okay, so maybe if you're me, I worked up. Or actually, I'll show you a mouse. Well, here's the mouse that you are going to be making. Mouse, mouse. All different kinds of mice. So here's the mice that we're the mouse that we're gonna be making today. Anyway, so let's get started with your mouse. So it's gonna look like this, and this is the mom mouse. And there will be some baby mice and all sorts of stuff. I just think that the mom mouse is the best. Um it's not dimensional. Well, yeah, what a minute. It's not 3G like and it's gonna Oh, it's kind of pretty so you don't pull that tight. Um, but it's not 3D. I'm just fixing its eye so you can see it better. But, you know, I think it looks pretty cute. Anyway. Oh, yeah, by the way, I'm going to do some other videos about how to make this minion that I made here. I'm going to make a minion later. I'm going to show it into a different video. But let's get started. So now you're going to put your loom in this configuration. This one, I guess. Where's the end at? Right there. And this configuration right here. And get your bands out. I like to just have them on the side. I'm just using light blue. You can make it like a real mouse or now, like a light pink or something. Anyway, but you're going to use all double bands, and if I don't say that, we're using double bands, okay? So, you can trust that we're using them. So, go from here to here, and you want to push down your bands, too. This is for beginners, remember, but, of course, advanced people like me can do them. And later, I'll show you how to... Push down all bands. All bands push down. Trust me, you're gonna thank me when we get to the end of it. Okay, now after we put let's see. after we put these two bands on both sides, now you're basically gonna decide. Am I going to make a baby mouse? Am I going to make a mom mouse? Or am I going to make a dad mouse? So, if you're going to make the kid mouse, like the baby kind of thing, you're going to go inwards. Now, if you're going to make the mom mouse, you're going to go one more forward. Then, you're going to go inwards. Just like that. And do the same thing on the other side. But if we're going to do the dad one, go one more. And then turn inward. Oops, sorry. That's why. Oops. I'm losing my bands right now. So I'm making the dad mouse. So I'm going to go all the way down. The, 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 I call them the dad mouse because they're bigger, you know. The one that I had right here, over here. This one, it's backwards too, guys, isn't it? Turn to tell them. Okay. So this mouse right here is a mom mouse. It's just gonna be like one bigger, you know. And now we're gonna add the extra color. See how on yours it has two colors? So I put I used two colors. See, here's my other color. And now you can take the other color, which I might use. I'll use pink. You don't have to use a second color, of course. I'm just going to. I don't know why either. Put the 
pink bands right there. Like that. So now you just made that part of it. And now we're going to fill in the middle part of it. So basically, you're just going to go down, I guess. You don't need any of your second color bands for this row. Just keep going, I guess. Don't need anything. Oops, let's start from on. Make it out. So go all the way down. Get more bands now. Okay, so just keep going down. Sorry about the background noise. Okay, so now after you completed that part of it. Now what we're going to do is we're going to add the, our uh, second color. So take some of the second color. Yeah, just saying that it's all double bands still. Even the snout. So now, this is where you have to watch me. I'm doing it opposite of you guys, so it's going to be hard for me. So let me see. So if you want that. Okay. So we're going to take two bands and you're going to put... um. From here to here, and listen to me, because otherwise you're, the snout of your my, mouse is going to look weird, and go out still. So, two outs, two out, like that, and then, then you're going to cover them up. Otherwise it will not turn out well. And that's going to, and then we're going to put a cap in, right on the end of that nose. And then the whiskers we'll do later, because you just put them on their temp. Or temporary, and I'll show you how to make them not temporary. Really, I guess it can fall off. Mine can fall off. See, I'll just slide it out. See, I'll show you how how to not make them fall off. Okay, wow. so it's, stuck in. it's cotton candy. Anyway, so let's put get our. Oh yeah, and you're gonna need a black band too for this for the eyes. So let's do the eye. You can use any color you want. I recommend black. Take your, your hook right here. And you're going to wrap it around and wrap this band. No, I'm going to do the easy way actually. Do the easy way anyway. Just do the easy way. Okay. I'm going to take a band and you're going to wrap this around four times. Or three if you want to. Two, three, four. And this will be the eye. Now move all those bands down if you need to. You can use your hook to just push them down. There we go. And now take the same first color of your, your body. Put it over there. And then you're going to, I just think it looks better. Push these down, of course. And grab that and put that right there. Then you're going to take all your bands, or just a couple of them at the time, and move them over onto this. So just grab them all. Don't go inside, go on the outside. See what I'm doing here? I'm going on the outside and I'm going to pull them right on top. And if you don't want to make another eye, you can. There we go. And then you just made your eye, and there's only one eye. I don't really like to put two. I think it's fine with one eye. It's just fine. One eye for me. And now let's put the cat bands on. These are all single. The cat bands are, by the way. Sorry if I said that. Now I'm going to push down the snout. Put one right there. You don't have to put this one there. I just kind of do it. I don't even know why I do that. Push these three bands. I mean, three, these, all the bands on this pin, this pin, and that pin down. Take a single of your body color. Put that right there. Push the next band, so the three bands down. Backwards triangle down. Back three. And push them down. Ta-da! And there. You're really done with your mouse. Now it's time for looping. Well, first we put the cat band on, don't we? So for your cat band, you can do any colors you want. I'm just going to use the first color, actually blue, for mine. You can use white, red. Red is really cute on it, but, you know, up to you. Now, I like to wrap it around three times for my cat band. One, two, three. 
sorry, I wrapped it around the nose piece right here. Nose piece, sorry. Thinking of my phone swimming things. Push it down a little. Well, I kind of like to push it a little up. Kind of make it one, I guess, fan. Now you're going to reach underneath there. Put some bands in here. Okay. You're going to reach underneath there and you're going to grab the first two bands. And you're going to put the first two bands. Not the bottom, not the ones in the bottom, the first two, and that should be over to this side. Grab the next two, and they are going to be toward the front. There we go. And now since we're done with that cap band, okay, now listen to me because it's going to be a little confusing here. So now, what we're going to do is we're going to do this one right here. We're going to go underneath here and we're going to grab the first two bands. And this should be, if you're doing mine, blue or the body color. Then you're going to take this one, these bands, these two bands, they should be your second color, and put them here. Oops, lost one. Ah, grab that one there. Put them from there. Then. And take this, the, the bottom two bands, and th that should go to right there. Then do this one. Then do the next one. Ah. And if they make that teardrop shape, you know, then you are good. 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 Huh, I'm saying. Anyway. So go in between there now, and just go forward. On all of them. Now it doesn't really matter which order. You can go from this. Sorry, this side. You can go from this side. This side. Well, sorry. You go so this side. Go this side. This side. You can go this one. Then this one. Then this one. You know, whatever you want to do, just go underneath. I know some people like to go like that with their hook. I like to do it a different way. I like to go like this and grab it, but that's just me. But you can go any way you want. Up this hook, up here. It doesn't really matter. Like now I'll go through the middle one. Oopsies. And you might want to use a metal hook for this. If you're using tight or tighter bands. You might want to use a metal hook because I wouldn't want you to break your hook on this. Because that would just kind of stink on a little mouse. But that's if you have tighter bands. The rainbow moon bands, they're fine, really. I like them. These are not rainbow moon bands. They're like these other ones that I got it, uh, at a garage sale. So, yeah. Oopsies. That side, too. Go on both sides. There's nothing else, really. Now, when it comes to the end... It's one way. Comes to the end here... I like to do the first one, and the, the, one, the one in the middle first, then just take whatever side you want and flip it, and we're towards the middle, like that. And you are done with your mouse, except for, I'll show you to make the little whiskers later. But stick your hook through all those bands in the middle. Do you see it right there? It's hard to see, kind of. No, Okay, I'm gonna switch it out towards you guys. Hello! I like to use the opposite color. Your second color. Oops, sorry. Grab the end and you're just gonna hold it from that side. And now you're just gonna roll oh, my finger. I'm gonna stick it through all those bands. It's a little hard sometimes. Ooh. I like to use a different color because it's easier to see. And then just put both sides on a hook. Take the one in the back. Take the one the okay. Take the this one. No, sorry. This one right here. 
one in the back, and I'm just gonna loop that through. Create a slip knot. Otherwise, you could use a C clip if you want. I just like slip knots better. And now I like to grab everything with that, with the um, my hook for the first one. Then just kind of take it off. And sorry if it's not in the camera. I'm just taking my design. Some people like to rip it off. I actually do it too. So and ta da! Oh, it's so cute. I like the dad one's the best. Ooh, the dad or the mom, not really the kids. Ta da! Oops. Oh, basically, you can poke out, pull out his eye more. Right there. You can stretch him out more if you want to. That's your basic guy. And now we're sure to make the little whiskers for him. Put them that way too. No, I think I like them better that way. This way, I like them better that way. Anyway, now what we're gonna make. I mean, sorry. Now what we're gonna do is we are going to put whiskers on. Not him. Him. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the copper whiskers. I'm just taking black for some reason. I don't know why. You can use clear too for using the rainbow balloon bands. Those works fine. And you're gonna stick it through that cap band that we made on his nose like that. See if all the bands are through right there. Don't worry, it won't hurt them. Take two bands, put it right on the end of that. Of your crochet hook or your rainbow hook. And you're just gonna stick the bands through there. Like that. Ta da! Whiskers for him. Isn't he cute? Isn't he cute? Isn't he cute? Well, now I'm going to show you. That's for the temporary mouse. That's for the temporary mouse. Now, if you want to make... Well, for the temporary whiskers. Now, if you want to make them permanent so they don't fall off, take both of them on your hook. And same thing. Except with double bands, you're just going to take them and you're going to go right through there. And now you can take a scissors. And excuse me because I forgot scissors. Of course. So, stay there. Okay, right here. Okay. So then what you're gonna do is then you're going to There you go. Now I like to cut them shorter. I uh, like to use them shorter. I'm just gonna spread them around like that. And there, you just made your little mouse. I think I like him better with the not really temporary ones. So I'm going to put the other kind back on him because I think he is a ton cuter. He's so adorable. Okay, I'm just gonna put them back. The heck? I'm just going to put them. I think he's cuter that way. Well, thank you for watching my video, and I'm gonna have more. Like I told you, I'm gonna have a minion. And then. And then. And then. Later, um. On. Kind of like the mouse with the. This. With the slip knot. With the temporary and not. You know. I don't know. But, anyway, so. Well, it's basically wrong. Why isn't it? Can't tell. Ah, stay! Stay. Um, and then later I'm gonna have a video on how to make this little mole. A little later I'm gonna make a video on how to make this little mole. And. So. And how to make a stitch on the rainbow room. Stitch from Lilo and Stitch. This stitch. I guess, and I did make him with legs and bigger, and I did not like him. I thought he was creepy, so I made him with legs, and I made him with very long ears. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I made him with light blue. I have dark blue now, so I'll make him in dark blue. But, basically, it's just fish ears, if you wonder. But, yes. And...
that's basically it, I guess. So, you know, I'm really excited. Yes, about making stuff like that. Anyway, but I'll have more stuff later for all you peoples. Yes, I know that it's so wrong. Hello, bananas. Bananas. Banana bananas. Okay. So, thank you. Bye. Woohoo, woohoo, woohoo. How do I turn this off?